Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Christian Aguilar. Today I'm wearing my Pokemon shirt in celebration of the Pokemon Go app. I am level 8 and I'm part of the Team Instinct, so comment down below what team you're on and what level you're on. If you do not know who I am, check out my 20 facts about Christian Aguilar video so that you can get to know me. It feels as if I have not published a new video in a very long time because I didn't post one last weekend and I was getting in the good habit of publishing a new video every weekend and then I just had to go and mess it up. <laughs> I'm so sorry, but I had a seven page research paper due the following Monday. So I hope all of you understand. Today's summer video is going to be about Starbucks secret menu rainbow drinks. I started a summer series here on my channel, so you should definitely subscribe to my channel so that you are notified every time that I publish a new video. I am pretty sure that you have seen this picture on social media and you've probably seen these drinks around town, especially the pink drink. I decided that I would do a taste test review on some of the drinks because I want to make sure that you are aware when you go and buy one of these drinks or if you want to see what all the hype is about or if there really is hype. Without further ado, let's get started. First, I am going to talk about the purple drink. For those who do not know what the purple drink is, it is a passion tangle tea with soy milk, add vanilla syrup, and blackberries. So the purple drink was very satisfying. The blackberries complemented the drink very well. If you have ever had a refresher, you know that there's tons of foam on top. I was trying to eat all my blackberries, but the foam was getting in the way and I just didn't like that combination. So that was the only thing I didn't like about the drink. I even had to throw away the blackberries with the ice and the foam because that was a very bad mix. Is it a drink I would get in the future? Probably, yeah. I can see myself purchasing that drink one more time. Next, I'm going to talk about the pink drink. This drink is... This drink has been the biggest trend from YouTubers drinking this and everyone around town. The pink drink is the strawberry acai refresher with no water. Replace it with coconut milk, but... I decided not to go with the coconut milk, I decided to go with the soy milk. Last weekend my co-worker bought the original pink drink and she gave me a taste. It wasn't good at all. She even said that she was kind of disappointed. But I was asking people if they enjoyed the drink because this is a drink that most people are buying. So I decided to ask co-workers and friends from school. One co-worker said that it was not her favorite. She said it was kind of disgusting. One co-worker said that it was okay. One co-worker loves it and she's always buying it. And some people are saying it's really good. So it's a 50 and 50. If you enjoy drinking coconut milk, this is the drink for you. But I decided to get it with soy milk and it was delicious. It tasted tropical. It was very sweet. So if you are someone with a sweet tooth, this is the drink for you. Next, I am going to talk about the green drink. Oh my gosh. I'm so sorry, but I tasted it. It's refreshing, but it's not the best. I really didn't enjoy this drink. For those who do not know what the green drink is, it is a black tea, add matcha, and add coconut milk. But as most of you know, I do not like coconut milk. Coconut milk really makes it taste sour. For the pink drink, it left a very bad aftertaste. I'm so happy that I tried the green drink for all of you because I thought it was going to be the exact same thing as the iced green tea latte, one of my favorite drinks. If you really want a green drink, because I know how hipster it looks to have a green drink, I recommend the sweetened iced green tea latte with non fat milk. That is it. I hope that all of you enjoyed this video. If so, give this video a thumb up. For those who are thinking why I didn't do a taste review on the orange and blue drink, well, the blue drink is similar to the purple drink minus the blackberries, and the orange drink was not available. I even walked to the other side of the mall to see if the other Starbucks had the orange drinks and ingredients, but sadly they didn't. Nonetheless, I hope everyone is enjoying their summer. Until next time, stay cool. 